So I want to talk to you about the two brain systems that you really need to understand if you want to learn how to overcome your limiting beliefs. And those are the rational brain and the emotional brain. Now the reality is that your brain and your mind are very complex and uh, even neuroscientists who've studied it for years don't fully understand every little part of the brain. They're still working on through all those details. But you don't need to know all that information in order to change your limiting beliefs. You just need to know about these two brain systems. And we call them the emotional brain and the rational brain. So let's take a look a little bit deeper inside your brain. So I want you to put your hand up into the air and put your thumb down on, on your palm against it and then close your fingers on top of your palm like you're making a bad fist. Now, don't ever punch someone with your fist like this. You'll break your, your thumb, by the way. If you do want to punch someone, make sure your fist is out, but uh, just don't punch someone in general. That's kind of a safer bet to do. Just this PSA brought to you by Josh Matthews Morgan. Okay, let's get that out of the way. Anyways, back to your brain. So there's really three main parts to your brain, or as what brain scientists call the triune brain, meaning three parts. And they kind of correspond with the rational and the emotional brain. So this, this part here at the top, or the fingers that are folded down over the top of your thumb, that is what we refer to as the rational brain. This is the part that they sometimes call the executive brain, where you do all of your rational thinking, your, your goals, your analytical thinking, all kind of happens up here. And uh, actually, this is what the part of our brain that makes us human and makes us so unique is how well-developed this neocortex area is, the rational brain is, in humans. Now, see, a lot of people think that that's really where it's at, that you know the rational brain controls our behavior and we're rational beings. And that's absolutely not true at all. The rational brain is really important, but it's not nearly as important for controlling your behavior and for impacting your limiting beliefs as the part below it, the emotional brain. Now the emotional brain is actually two, two parts of the brain called the limbic area, that's this, this thumb area, and the brain stem, which you might think of as like the bottom of your palm, the base of your palm here. Um, we like to just kind of group them together and call them the emotional brain because it's simpler and because they do really feed off of each other and they really impact each other and influence each other a lot. So the gist of this to understand is that a lot of people, the way that they approach changing limiting beliefs is a very rational brain way of doing it. They try to convince it using reason and logic and that only appeals to this rational brain. But if you're struggling with the limiting belief, the problem isn't with your thinking brain, right? And the problem is in the, this feeling area, the emotional brain, uh, in the limbic area, and specifically with a region called the amygdala, which we'll get into in the next video when we talk about the threat response. But anyways, uh, I, I wanna share with you briefly before we close this video, a simple image that we'll use from now on to sort of talk about this rational emotional brain dichotomy, and that is the stick person image. So you can also call the rational brain, the thinking mind, and the emotional brain, the feeling mind, below the rational brain. So rational brain, thinking brain, uh, emotional brain, feeling mind, that's all, those are all interchangeable, okay? I wanted to make sure you understand that. For the purposes of this guide, just think of them as very similar, okay? So anyways, hope you enjoyed that. I hope you learned a little bit more about your brain and your fists. Let's move on to the next section when we talk about how this emotional brain really works so you can really dive in and understand it.